What's up everyone and welcome back to the club. In today's video, we're drawing Stu from Brawl Stars. Let's begin by drawing the inside of the helmet trim. We're gonna start over on the left side. We're gonna start with a straight line going across from left to right, to right about there. And it comes straight down the sides. We'll start with the left, bring that down, and draw that same length line on the right side. Let's round out the bottom of the trim. Starting back on the left, we draw a half circle, coming down and then up. I just want to pull this back up towards the top. And I'll round out the top corners of the trim, starting back on the left, go up and then bend that in. And it'll connect the inside with a straight line. And now we're going to tuck that center eye in underneath the trim. Starting on the left, we're going to step in and draw a half circle. Come down, round up the bottom, and then pull that up on the right. Let's trace this out along the inside. Stepping in, come down, and then back up. Now I'm going to leave a gap in the center and draw two straight lines. One on the left, one on the right. Close off the bottom. I'm going to fill that area in black. Let's go to the bottom of the trim and add a slight curve. Starting on the left, I'm going to go up towards the eye and then bend that back down. And now we'll draw the outside of the helmet. Starting on the left side of the trim, I'm going to curve this out, come up, and then in towards the middle. Continue up towards the right, down along the side, and then bend that back in. Let's add a stripe on the side of the helmet. Starting over on the left, draw a straight line coming down. Line this up on the right. I'm going to step in and draw that again. Let's add two chevrons in the center of the helmet. Starting right in the middle, step up, start with a point. Now from here we're going to angle up and out toward the left and right side. Go up along the sides and we'll pull that back in towards the middle. Let's go back to the center, step up, start with another point, follow that same angle line going out toward the left and right, go straight up just underneath the top of the helmet, and we'll pull that back down toward the center. Let's move down and draw on the collar. We're going to start on the left side, start by curving down then in towards the center, go out, and then up. And I'll draw that same curve just down below, going up and then down. Let's go back underneath the trim on the left side. I'm just going to taper this down and back in towards the center, go out and up on the right. Let's go halfway along this curve, bend the collar going out and then down. Line this up on the right. And then we'll round out the side of the collar. Starting back on the left, go out, up, and then in underneath the head. And then we'll thicken up the inside edge of the collar. Starting on the left, draw a short line coming in on both sides. And we'll follow that same curve going up and in, and we'll gap along the top. And I'll taper that back down and then in towards the center. Let's add two small stars on the tip of the collar. Starting on the left, come down and out towards the left and right. Go straight out towards the side. Come down and then in. Now I'm draw the bottom of the star. Come 
down and out. Pull that back up and in toward the center. Let's do the same thing on the right. So we're just gonna line up the top. Now I'm gonna tuck the side of the body underneath the collar. I'm gonna start from the inside, step up, to the curve the body, coming down and then in. And then from here, draw a straight line coming down towards the hips. Let's connect the hips with the straight line. Let's connect the top and the hip with a half circle. And come in and bend that back out. And I'll add a small circle in the middle. Now I'm going to move to the center and draw on the zipper. Leaving a gap in the center, go to the left side, draw a straight line coming down, move over towards the right, draw that again, and then we'll add a trim. Stepping out, draw another line on either side. Let's go to the center of the body, start with a straight line going across the top, coming down the sides, and then we'll close off the bottom. Now from the side of the rectangle, draw a straight line going out towards the side. Let's move up, draw a straight line going across the top, the bottom. Now from the center of the head, draw a straight line coming down in behind the zipper, and then we'll continue along the bottom. Now I'm gonna leave a gap underneath the hips and draw the top of the belt. So starting on the left, step down, draw another straight line going across, straight down the side of the belt and we'll close off the bottom with a straight line. And then from the hips, we're going to step in, draw a short line coming in to connect the body. Let's add a star in the center of the belt, starting from the very top and move down and out toward the side, Look straight out, come down and in and come down and out towards the bottom of the belt. Now we'll pull that back up towards the center. Let's add two circles on either side. And we'll add a half circle on the side of the belt, going out and then in. Let's layer the tire underneath the belt. We start over on the left, Start with a straight line coming down, go over towards the right, do that again, coming down to the same height, and we'll close off the bottom with a slight curve, coming down and then up. Let's move back up to the top, step out, and draw a straight line coming down about halfway. Round up the bottom and then pull that in towards the side of the tire. And I'll draw that same sized half circle on the side, going out and then in. Now let's move back up and draw on the arms. From this point, we're going to step up, curve the arm going out, and then down towards the wrist. Line this up on the right, going out and down. And I'll round out the cuff, starting back on the left, go out and then up. And then we'll add a thick cuff along the bottom of the arm. Starting back on the left, draw a straight angle line. And we'll follow that same curve, coming down and then in. From the top of the cuff, we step in, curve the arm coming up and in underneath the collar. Let's tuck the hands in underneath the sleeve. Starting from the inside, draw a half circle. And in and then out. Close off the end with a bracket. And we'll add three fingers on either side. Starting from the bottom of the thumb, come down, then bend that up around the bracket. And we'll add two more fingers. Step down, go down, then up. And then along the side, flip out and up 
underneath the sleeve. I'm also going to add a small button on the side of the cuff. Let's start on the left, draw a half circle, do the same thing on the right. And now we're going to layer the cape in behind the body. Let's start underneath the thumb, come down, then bend that out, do the same thing on the right. And I'll connect the ends with a curve, coming down and then in behind the tire, line this up on the right, pull it out, and bend that up. And that's pretty much it. There's Stu from Brawl Stars. I hope you enjoyed today's lesson. Make sure you subscribe and send me your requests in the comments below. Thanks for watching and we'll see you again soon.